So this video is a little tutorial on how to do a cool effect. So for this first drill, we're going to bend our arms and we're going to try and bring our stomach to the bar and we're going to pike around the bar. If you arch around the bar, all your weight's going to be here and it's going to be harder to make this pull up. So on this first drill, we're not quite going all the way up, but we're just going to bend our arms and pike and try and get our stomach to the bar a little bit. Trying to get the bar to hit in this uh, hip area right here. When you're ready, you can go a little bit harder and try to pull it for real. And one more thing, you also want to try and keep your head in neutral. If your head goes back, it's going to make you arch, which is going to make this trick harder. Keep your head in neutral, or you can even look down at your toes the whole time if you want. For girls that are competing in pullover on a low bar, you're not going to be able to start with one foot in front and keep off like that. You're going to have to start with two feet together. But it's pretty similar. You're going to start with your feet together, and you're going to bang your arms, and you're going to jump a little bit, and you're going to pick it on the bar. So Eric here is nice enough to help us out, and I'm just going to demonstrate how you can spot a pullover on a low bar. First, he's going to grab the bar. In the beginning, it's easier if he just picks up his right leg, straight leg. And I'm going to start holding like this, my other hand's right here by his shoulder. And on three, he's going to kick off that bottom leg, and he's going to pike around the bar as I spot his shoulder. One, two, three. Just like that. And when he does it more by himself, you can just stand right here. And I'm just going to spot like this. Just like kind of kick away. I'm also going to show you a pullover in the high bar without swinging, which is called either a dead hang pullover or a chin up pullover. And you can do it uh, one of a couple of ways. A chin up pullover is you're going to bend your arms first and then bring your hips to the bar. Or you can pull at the same time with your arms and pull over. And there's also a swinging pullover or a long hang pullover where you're going to do tap swings of hollowing or hollow into your pullover. And real quick, I'm going to show you how to spot or how I spot a pullover in the high bar. He's going to jump up and do three tap swings. I'm going to put my hand on his shoulder and I'm going to put my other hand on his leg. I'm just going to push him around like this. And he's going to generate swing on his own or you can help him generate swing. One, hollow him back, two, and lift my hand on the shoulder, and just 